Dear students, in this video I will explain phase diagram for lead silver system. Uh, it consists of temperature versus composition. From left to right, the percentage of silver decreases, percentage of lead increases. The red color curve that I have drawn here is the uh, melting point depression curve of the silver. Blue color curve is the melting point depression curve of the lead. Melting point of silver is 961 degrees Celsius. Uh, but the melting point of lead is only 3 to 7 degree Celsius, which is lower, very much lower than that of the silver. So, at point O, uh, which is called as the eutectic point, the solid lead and the solid silver will be in equilibrium with that of the liquid melt. So, okay, so that point is called as the eutectic point where solid lead solid silver will be in equilibrium with that of their own liquid melt above this there is an area right so there only the liquid melt of uh, uh, silver and then the lead will exist no solid phases here so the number of phase here is the one so we need to follow condensed phase rule that is f is equal to c minus p plus one not plus two because the pressure term is eliminated there is no vapor phase here so pressure term is eliminated so f is equal to c that is component number of component is 2 minus 1 the minus p uh, number of phase here is 1 so 2 minus 1 plus 1 equal to 2 so the system is bivariant under this area along the curve uh, let, now let us calculate the degrees of freedom so f is equal to c minus p plus 1 right so, number of component is 2, number of phase here along the curve is 2 because the solid along the red color curve, the solid silver will exist in equilibrium with the liquid melt. So, F is equal to 2 minus 2 plus 1 equal to 1. So, the system is univariant along the curves and uh, bivariant under the area. Uh, at eutectic point, so where three phases exist, solid silver, uh, solid lead and their liquid melt all the three are existing in equilibrium right so number of phases is equal to 3 so f is equal to 2 minus 3 plus 1 so f is equal to 0 so the system is non-variant at the eutectic point so what is the composition of the eutectic mixture eutectic mixture composition consists of 97.4 percentage of the uh, lead and then the 2.6 percentage of the silver so this is the eutectic mixture and the temperature of the or the melting point of this eutectic um, uh, mixture is 303 degree celsius so eutectic mixture will have a constant uh, melting point so that is uh, 303 degree celsius so under this area solid eutectic mixture and the solid silver will exist in the right hand side solid eutectic mixture and the solid lead will exist let us take a point p so uh, at this point uh, the silver composition is very very low less than 0.1 percentage so that is called as argentiferous lead where the lead composition is more so when we freeze this system uh, it uh, follows this dotted line when and reaches the blue color curve so at that point lead crystallizes out because lead uh, melting point is lower right so it crystallizes out so we can remove that uh, the crystals of lead can be removed so the liquid melt will have more percentage of the um, silver or the silver percentage is gradually increased so when it reaches uh, the O uh, uh, there uh, the composition of the silver will be 2.6 percentage so this process by which we are increasing the concentration or the composition of the silver uh, from 0.1 percentage to 2.6 percentage is said to be the Parkinson's process